Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your daily reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Aquarius with a clear, concise message from you. All right, let's see what's going on for my Aquarius. How is Aquarius coming into the week on this Monday? All right, let's see. The, the Knight of Wands has been coming out a lot. So it's like you're trying to take some fast action. You try to do it. You have a lot to do. You know, you're trying to get a lot done. Maybe in a short amount of time, you get the star card coming out. These cards are old, but they're, they're trusted and true. Oh, fast move. The chariot card. This could even like a physical move. It's like the universe is propelling you to make some move here, like pushing you. Like the universe is saying, look, we have aligned things for you. The stars are aligned because the chariot card can talk about astrology. Um, for you to make some fast move. Now the window is closing. It's not going to be open, you know, as long as, you know, you think it will be. You need to act fast, says uh these cards here, Aquarius. Let's see what else is going on for the Aquarius. Yeah, the King of Swords, act fast, um be very decisive, strategic in your approach to something. You, you know, there is ambition here. It's strategic strategy, the seven of swords. So maybe you need to plan something a little bit better. It needs to be revision of plans or you need to keep your plans to yourself. Okay. Whatever you're trying to do, make sure that it will get done by way of holding, you know, knowledge to self right now. It's not a place where you need to gather all and, um, where you need to gather around gather people around and tell them your business or you need to put it out on front street or you need to post it on social media you don't you need to keep to yourself at this time so that you can see victory over short-term goals with the chariot card some of you are trying to lose weight or you're losing weight you you have the ability to gain and lose weight fast here in the chariot card something about propelling you forward taking this prime opportunity to do so but having a lot of strategy with a plan strategy plan um if you do not have a plan uh, then you no plan is a plan to fail you know so make sure that you do because um uh, you don't want to have uncertainty fragility in your future the four of swords and the four of swords talks about thinking about the future it talks about a break it talks about rest um so it just says that you just need to take a step back and you need to make sure um everything is going to work out the way you have planned if you have a plan you know you can't be flying by the uh, seat of your plant your pants here uh the four of swords so some of you have taken a break from somebody it is temporary you just thought it's too much drama going on between the two of you you know you could feel that way it could be with a masculine energy that is maybe your soulmate you had some communication with this person. Maybe they want to come in and rush in and approach, but something is holding them back. It could be the universe, you know, asking them to look at something from a different perspective or sacrifice something, make the sacrifice. Sacrifice of change is what I heard. Yeah, be healthier in their approach to relationships. Make a decision, a choice of who you want to be devoted to. Yeah, stop playing the you know the middle ground here going backwards and forward you can't rest in duality for too long you got to decide so the universe could be holding someone back from you because they're just not ready the five of cups they do miss you you miss them there's regret remorse you know sadness because maybe they can't come towards you yeah they also understand the true nature of the relationship you guys met for a reason there was divinity involved in the meeting and what you guys chose to do after you met it was all free will. Um, so, but someone is now understanding, you know, this wasn't haphazard. This wasn't, you know, um, it wasn't their intention. It was definitely divine or divinely orchestrated. So someone's understanding that. Therefore, they're taking the relationship serious. If someone's getting some revelation, some sudden upheaval about, what you mean to them or vice versa this is what you're doing or it's mutual or someone has gotten that information let's see what is happening in the near future for you aquarius what's happening for aquarius in the near future 
you got some big plans happening this week or today you got to make a, a move Aquarius you know you can't sit on your hands with this one the universe has really aligned some things for you especially with the will of fortune um, the chariot card giving so it's it's you and the universe pushing you forward you know giving you that victory you just have to act universe spirit is just that spirit universe they aren't people you are the person so all they can do is what they can do in their realm and you need to do what you can do so some of you need to take some action let's see wealthy man coming up in your near future i heard hallelujah all right so somebody's happy about that um or you could be the wealthy man money is coming into you. there's going to be a complete change of status here for you either someone is going to offer you this lifestyle change or you're offering this to yourself by way of all the hard work effort that you have put into yeah somebody wants a new start with you someone could offer you something small initially they're trying to see what you'll if you'll take to it if they have opportunity with you um you could have less money than them or vice versa it could be the other way around you have more money than them they have less than you um, but someone is definitely ready ready to you know have that childlike love with you that innocence back with you or they feel like you are innocent um the courthouse is like aquarius you got a lot going on this day this week good news is coming though you know especially in terms of court matters it's just like paperwork matters pushing paperwork pesky little things you need to do changing this and changing that getting the card title going to government agencies and filing this paper and that paper and i need to go get this and my business license and occupational license and this and that it's that type of energy with the courthouse when it comes up or it could be that you know a settlement is coming for you but we got to get a signature here and a signature there from this person and that person all over there so it's just more so just that little you know that run around that paper uh paper pushing but whatever the message is is definitely good this is a good news message maybe within seven days could be seven hours it, it, the card says seven days so um that's that's what you have to look forward to this week aquarius very nice looks like uh, what else do we have for aquarius wow a new pathway something you have been doing for one to two years is really paying off for you or are you going to be able to go into a new direction with it or are you going to take it into a new direction you're going to be like the butterfly and have transformation here you will be like mariah carey and spread your wings and prepare to fly okay oh come on spirit prepare to fly okay that's what i heard um you have been in a cycle going over and over something or doing something over and over again this also could be an indication of maybe an entrepreneur doing something over and over again trying to get that thing that business like a wheel where it just turns you know a wheel will turn you give it a push it'll keep turning you know until it you know it has resistance but um it looks like Aquarius, you're at a place where things are really shaping up and changing for you. Could have something to do with a, a courtship or one will come into you. Uh, someone is definitely, again, like we saw in the cards, in despair, heartbreak over you. Could be you, you know, over someone else or it could be mutual. Some relationship was very much hard work here and you just, you couldn't stay in it much longer. Let's see with the Island Time Wellness cards. I could be wrong. Yeah. Oh, I got it right. Island time wellness cards have to say. All right, let's see. What do the island time wellness cards have to give to the Aquarius? Really good reading. You've been getting some really good readings. The, I couldn't make it up to Dragonfly. Be lighthearted. Finding out things. Coming to light. Adapt, change, and heal. Very nice. The snake competition. Enemy clever. Malicious look over your shoulder. The other woman. Someone could just be outright jealous of you because you got so much going on for yourself and around you let's see there could be someone you know trying to with that seven of swords it could even be a friend you know it says loss of friendship there could even be someone trying to weasel their way or snake their way you know slither their way back into your life um they could be showing up in your dream space also yeah not enough maybe in the past someone did not give enough in a relationship and it was karmic okay it, meaning it was you had to learn a lesson it was karma you know there so it was karmic so just meaning that, okay, I have a lesson to learn. Not about, um, it could be about the people you choose, but it also most times lessons are for you. So it's about you. So it's about what did you do? Why didn't you choose right? Why didn't you? So it's more so digging deep into you. Go, maybe even having to go all the way back to childhood. Oh, I never choose right because 
you know, I, I thought I was less than when I was growing up and I wasn't told I was pretty and I was this and that. So a karma, karmic lesson is for you, about you. It's not about, you know, the, um, the exterior, the, the um, external person. Those people are going to be them and they have to learn the karmic lesson for themselves. So keep that in mind. Karma is for you. It's not, you know, like, oh, I put you with this horrible person so that you could see horrible people. No, you already know horrible people. But you have to ask the question, why did you stay? Why did I stay with horrible person? Why did I look past red flags? Why didn't I leave? Why didn't I put my foot down? Why didn't I? So karma's for you. So you were in some karmic relationship. Hopefully you learned the lesson. If you did not, you, you know, you're going to have to go back around. Pass go again. So hopefully you want to finish up the game. Okay. Um, let's see. What else do we have for Aquarius? Passion, insane chemistry, liking each other, having fun. So you could have that going on this week for you. It looks like a really exciting week. Ascending. Some of you are ascending your experience in headache. Um, I know I had nasal issues, went outside, uh, allergies. Some of you could be experiencing that. You're ascending, transcending obstacles. We saw that in the pathway card coming out, um, a new phase, preparing for union. And look what comes after that love, unconditional love, self-love, one is passion again, coming up for you. Um, affection and attraction. This is very good, Aquarius. This card wants to show its face. Healing heart. Yeah, some of you are healing from heartbreak, a karmic or tox no, toxic relationship or addiction. Yeah, some of you are just heartbroken or you were or someone is in regards to you. You won't take them back. You don't feel like you need this. Um, it's it's not adding to it, it could be reducing, it could be subtracting from you. So you might be telling someone, no, uh, your body is perfect. OK, your body will work or your body is perfect. You're working on your perfecting your body. We did talk about working out valentine's day this always comes out for you guys valentine's day either 2022 was very significant for you aquarius or it will be in 2023 this also could come out in terms of self-love too or just love altogether you'll feel like every day is valentine's day with this new person this new wealthy man or woman coming into your camp you got love again you got love in another deck so crazy this love could have failed or there was failure with this love in the past um again somebody felt like they weren't giving enough but now they want to come back around you could be giving someone a second chance illness and sickness um someone someone had gone through something and maybe you helped them out in terms of them being ill or sick you gave to them or you knew that this person was not being nice to you or a good person to you but yet and still you you continue to to show them love unconditional love and this person is now has fallen in love with you you could be mixed race or it could be a white black type of we got a chariot card white black type of relationship where you're white or they're black or the other way around or there's just like mixed race here in terms of the relationship or whomever you're dealing with also this could come out in terms of uh, mixed minds you know someone of two minds about something yeah and this is why you say i can't take you back i can't take you serious i can and i don't take you serious so you know shrug you just gotta shrug it off um Let's see what else do we have for Aquarius and then we'll get out of here. It looks like a really good week. Some of you will be reconciling. There was separation because someone was too much of a live wire. You didn't know what you were getting from day to day. It was love one day, hate the next or just discontentment or, um, you, you know, you just couldn't read this person. But now somebody's at a place that I want to surprise you with a new life, new baby, new car. Surprise. It's a big old surprise. Very nice. Because somebody is now obsessed with you they stare at your picture for hours okay um this is what i have for you aquarius if it resonates let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section go over to the website and book your own reading there ask a question or two by texting it to the number below you can also catch me live every tuesday thursday and sunday night 9 30 p.m eastern standard time come join the channel click the join button right there yep you see it scroll down yep join that join our channel and you'll get access to um, ex ex exclusive videos and also extended videos. And you get to ask me one question or two, depending on which membership level you choose. You get to ask uh, a question every month. Okay. So this is what I have for you, Aquarius. Many blessings to you. Take care.